I will hold my baby in my hand for the whole night while he sleeps because he just will not sleep in his bed. Imagine doing that for a week. Five mistakes that new moms make. Number one, diagnosing your child. If you feel like there are changes or you've noticed changes in your child, make sure you keep monitoring your child. You can contact your pediatrician and let them know. Do not go to the internet and read about things and start thinking that your child has got those things. You are going to freak out. It's going to make you really stressed and you won't like it. Number two, co-sleeping with a child on the same bed. Aside from incidents leading to death, your child can smell you your child can feel your presence and therefore every minute they will want to be attached to you even if they don't need to breastfeed they will want to be close to you and that will make you sleepless and destroy your every chance of having a nap three not taking care of the baby's hair when the children are born they have really soft and nice hair if you do not take care of this hair um from an earlier stage the texture will change and you will are uh, really going to struggle make sure that you are able to hold the hair pamper the hair you know moisturize the hair and do all those kind of lovely things you will do to your own hair trying to do it all by yourself make sure you ask for help having a baby is really hard thing make sure that you get some rest when the baby is sleeping Get some rest but you might be thinking you are maternity leave you're going to have a lot of time at your disposal you schedule a lot of things that is not it you are going to be changing diapers be looking after the half of your family you're going to be looking after the baby who will be attached to you 24 7 you do want to get to sleep trust me another thing is not introducing bottle feeding to your child as earlier as possible even if you want to breastfeed exclusively that is all right but make sure you do pump your breast milk if you introduce bottle to the child later on they may refuse this and if in case you need to go back to work or go out and do other things this is going to be really hard on both yourself and the child so learn how to pump your breast milk at an earlier stage store it and you can give the child in a bottle um, and also make sure that you are giving to your partner or somebody else to give them so that they are acquainted with them or get used to somebody else if these are mistakes that you are making i hope that you learn from this video and advise yourself or share this video to anyone who is expecting or are planning to have babies and i hope you love it Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video.